figure a way to get him the ball. He makes you look good when you do it. Play action, Granger drop. They give it to Carroll. Why wouldn't you give it to him? Safety to force him back inside. They fake it to him and they release it out. Second and four. Carroll. Carroll trudging forward. That'll move the sticks. Carroll. They'll let him try to punch it in. Fumble ball is out. Going back the other way. Kendra Gant. Down, but breaks the cardinal sin of your red zone ball security rules. So for the first time, we get to see Zeon Chris and the Louisiana yeah, often. He'll flip Cabote over. Chris looking on the near side, and it's dropped by Peter LeBlanc. Deion Chris has been giving them third down. To the far side, overthrows his intended body. That went off the fingertips of Leach, too. He almost picked it right back, but a stop for Georgia State, which is what they needed after the two. You want a good memory on home. You're supposed to win on homecoming, right? Second drive for Georgia State. They fumbled on the goal line on the Robert Lewis, but he, he's really kind of a different receiver that they like to use in a lot of different ways. Back to Carroll. And Granger talks it. Not going to be close at all. Louisiana. He lost the force to punt. So Cade Loggins to punt. Jacob Bernard is back for the Raging Cajuns. He's going to try to return it. Zeon Chris, so you know he's loving what Zeon Chris is giving him. You could. Second and five. Chris dropping back. Now he moves. The field, there's 21. Watch him kind of follow him with your eyes. He squeaks out of the backfield. Zylan Perry is wide open. He just doesn't see him. Chris to the near side. Jacob Bernard is his target. Oh, hits a guy. Deion Chris pulls it. Takes a hit. Still able to get only one more yard after that. Play action for Zeon Chris. Got to move. Scary. Dumps it full. Kind of live and beat you with his right arm from inside the pocket. Slings it quickly to Charles Robertson. Progress picks up a yard on the play. This is Draylon Washington. Design run for Chris. He pulls it. First down. Chris to the near side, targeting Harvey Broussard and threw it behind him. Sing situations. Cabote goes in motion. Chris going up the middle. First down, tripped up as he goes past the 25-yard line. It's a pretty good call then, right? Third and 10, everybody's thinking pass. And this is a quarterback draw, folks. I mean, this is offensive lineman down the field. That, that's not a... Zylan Perry gets the handoff, spinning his way around to about the 17. That convert those to touchdowns. Chris going up top to the corner of the end zone in traffic in the pass. Nation in red zone defense. Chris, nobody where to go. Second and two here for Granger. Marcus Carroll. First down. And with him, it's not. It really is him. He's he's an old lineman at heart, old line coach at heart, and he loves going out there and wrestling with his guys pregame. Darren Granger with a shot to Tyler. Yard pickup. They go back to the ground game with Marcus Carroll. Williams right here in the slot, right there in the middle of the field, running that post route, and he turns that safety for Louisiana Jalen Clark around. That is a. And there's some movement. Uh, against Georgia State. Full start. Offense number 79. Penalty that we've had tonight. Oh, everybody coming for Granger, and he gets rid of the football. 
Williams, who had the big catch, is not on the field. Over the top to Amon Green. Touchdown, Georgia State. Green's first touchdown catch of the season. Well, he to Amon Green, he was so wide open. Yeah, green grass for Amon Green. With you from Lafayette. And Amon Green just got his first career touchdown catch. Zylan Perry tries to run this one out for Louisiana. but uh, For Georgia State, is attached in a three-point stance, and he just runs scot-free down the middle of the field. So a, a linebacker for Louisiana has got to get what we call hands on him there. Three point presentation. I great. Chris keeps it. Rush him in passing situations. Don't let him get outside of him and, and, and force this young quarterback to beat you with his right arm. He's three for eight on the night, and he'll sling it down the field. Eric kind of falls through the arms of Peter LeBlanc and ends up trapping it. I don't think he ever really fully used it as a run. Pressure in his face. Gets rid of the football. No options because Justin Abraham. And a free shot right on the young quarterback. Jakari Carter back for Georgia State. And Thomas Leo takes a hit. Flags come out. To the kicker. I mean, he doesn't let the kicker land. So that's a roughing the kicker. Back to work here. Marcus Carroll to the 31 yard. The running back and the quarterback. Third down, and Georgia State is able to convert, so they're now four for five. See here, the free defender right here is, is number 19. He comes crashing down the line of scrimmage and make that play with one yard to go anyways. Granger's going to throw on the move. You lose a little bit of leverage, and he's out the back door for a big game. ...by Darren Granger. He started nine for nine. Down the sideline! And they'll dump it off. Amon Green. Right there for a touchdown. Now what? Yeah. And you know what? That's exactly what they did on their first drive. They fumbled and turned the ball over. So what? Now what? They're up 13 nothing. I thought it was interesting. They talked about, yeah, how does 24 gassers coming back after July 4th holiday sound tough? Disgusting. <laughs> I mean. Darren Granger on the move, and specifically with Darren Granger. Did he lose his football? Drilling on the field is a fumble. Recover. And they'll hand it off to Marcus Carroll. Guys, the third leading rusher in college football in terms of yards per carry. And again, when the big plays happen. Four in Louisiana territory. Option, they'll pitch it back to Carroll. Palacerdo using him. Carroll. In. Why not give him the ball again? Picks up. 